G'day and welcome back for more Survival Unlikely and go back. Wait, wait, I see you there. How did you even get back there? Why are you re why are you even back there? I was just looking around the place. Right, did you find anything interesting? I might need somewhere to find hide my stash. Stash of what? Stash of what? Nothing. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, so I've made a few changes in here, as you might yeah, say. What? What is? What is all this? So this is kind of your control seat. How am I supposed to take a break in the break room with all these glowing things and boutons? What do these do? Well, there are. Th so the buttons control the lights. What are these green things? I think they're the thrusters. It's a floor plan script that is really cool, and I thought would be nice to put up there that shows the cockroach up there. What are all these it? numbers? Inventory, power, power graphs, and then the controls for the floor plan script. I'm not going to have to pay attention to any of these, am I? It was the kind of the idea was for you to pay attention to it. Although, are you going to be flying up in here and then moving to your ship that's underneath when we go to the moon? Or are you going to be flying in your ship? Uh, I'll probably stay in the ship. It'll be easier to launch if I'm if I'm there ready to go. Okay. Um, if well... I Gotta coordinate with these warheads. You're lo you're all loaded up, aren't you? Yep. I've got a I've got all the stuff I need to make a little base on the moon. Okay. Well, do you want to hop in yours? Because I've got all the stuff to make a hole into the ground on the moon. Okay. Have a look. Oh wait, no. There's another thing I gotta show you over here what? first. Gun rack. Mm. And there's ammunition in the bottom. So just in case you get killed, you can come back and these grab a gun. These guns from are here. the wrong color. I think when you take them, they'll get your colour. Well, I've already got, got mine anyway. Yeah. But then have a look at the front. Uh... What... What is this supposed to be? Look at the other side of it. The other side? Yeah. Like the top side? Yeah. It just looks like blocks to me. Further away. And don't run into me this time. Oh. What are all these things? Warheads! Ah! They're not armed, they're inert. What if I shoot them? They're still inert. They won't explode. No, don't, don't shoot them. Oh, I had I to try. Don't want them damaged. So the idea will be is that I'll drop these and I'll try and line them up one behind the other. So okay. they'll blast a nice deep hole that you can then go into and be relatively safe while you mine out a hole big enough for this. All right, let's, let's get going. Okay, so hot bars all set. And if you're interested in looking at the cockroach or using it yourself or modifying it, whatever, it's actually going to be on the workshop because this is kind of a version we're happy with. Obviously, the version that's going to be on the workshop is not going to have those warheads on the front or Capac ship underneath, but you'll be able to explore what we've done. Yeah. The link will be in the top of the description. Alrighty. Unlocking from the ground. Uh, make sure you take off straight up so that I get clear of this ice hole. That better? Hmm. Do you feel safer now? Uh, I'm kind of facing sideways. <laughs> You're going to be staying sideways for a bit. Well. Because away we go. That's right. I'll just play video games on the display. Sure, you do that. Uh, one of the things that we're going to have to keep in mind is that when we get to the moon, we're going to need a fuel supply. So we're going to need to find some ice. Ice? Yeah. I know there's ice on the moon. So we're going to need to find that, and that's going to be our landing site. Somewhere relatively close to it, so that we can collect some while we're there. Also, did either of us make a GPS? Isn't, isn't the base got GPS? No, nope, I just made one above it, so it's okay. Uh, our speed seems to be decreasing. Yes, it is, but I think we'll still manage to make it clear. You're a lot heavier than I gave you credit for. Well, that's just rude. Actually, I wonder if we can gain speed this way. Yeah, there we go. Well, you should probably start angling towards the moon anyway. Yeah, that's better. Now we're picking up some speed. Yeah, there we go. Now we're accelerating just on the big thrusters. That's what I wanted. Okay, 95% fuel. Now I can start winding this back so that we're, our override isn't pushing against the speed cap. And there we go. Nice. We should make it with a fair amount of fuel left. 
Well, as long as we don't run into any space babies. Space babies? Yeah, like in that movie. What? What? Are you talking like aliens, or are you talking? What are you talking? Two thousand one. Oh, that's There's not a space, space baby. babies up in orbit, just drifting about the place. That's why we need to send something into orbit with a laser to clear out all the, the space junk and the babies that are drifting around. You want to laser space babies? Yeah. <laughs> Jeez. Well, you kind of have a that's baby rough. colliding with your spaceship at hundreds of meters per second. It could be very dangerous. So what are we doing up here anyway? So we're going to the moon so that we can establish a little bit of a presence there. Uh, since that's where we hope to get our gold and our silver from. And then, once we've done that, we need to get to Mars so we can get some platinum. I have vague memories of the moon being very hostile last time we were there. It is very hostile. <laughs> that's why we're taking a lot more armament with us this time. <laughs> and hopefully, some ability to dig a hole quickly. Well, I mean, that's easy for you to say. Your ship is festooned. Yes, you are completely unarmed. I'm aware of this. I mean, I guess I could try to drill drill an enemy <laughs> ship. You could. It, it might even work, because the drills can take a fair bit of impact, so you could just ram them. Mm. Oh, it looks like I hadn't used up on my ice yet, because uh, my fuel gauge is actually going up. Uh. And now we're getting low on actual ice now. So we'll be down to just tanks. Uh, including my tanks, apparently. Oh, am I using your tanks? Yes. Turn them to stockpile. And then just make sure once you disconnect, you, you take them off stockpile again. There we go. Leeching away all my precious fuel. I've got a surprise for you once we reach orbit as well. Are we almost in orbit? I've got about another 10 kilometers to go. 10 kilometers? I can't wait that long. I want my Christmas presents now. I said surprise, not present. Same thing. Where's the tree? Well, I could have put Christmas lights on this. Someone has made a mod for that. Hmm. That would be very seasonal. It would be somewhat seasonal. Love me some seasonings. Alright, preparing to detach. No, you don't detach yet. You gotta wait till I've... So, the plan for your deployment is for me to line up these warheads dropping towards the moon, try and get them all in as close to a perfectly straight line as I can, and you to follow them. So I'll launch them at about 80 meters a second so that you have some ability to catch up, but don't catch up too close. Uh, how are we gonna determine a, a target zone? Well... We'll scout the moon and see where, from the, from orbit or from closer in, we can actually see what looks like it might be ice, and just hope that it is ice. Uh. I think, um, like other planets, the moon's ice is at the poles as well, but I don't really know which way the poles are, although I can probably judge it off the Earth like So we're choosing a landing zone by hoping for ice. Yes. Do you have a problem with that? Yeah, we're gonna be on the moon in no time. Full you, speed ahead. You don't know the half of it. Huh? I said you don't know the half of it. Ooh, I, do we have some kind of fancy solar sail? Nope. Huh? What's all this stuff? Three, ah. two, one. What? Off we go. Ah. Wait, did oh. I go too far? Oh no, the moon's still there. Oh, I don't feel so good. I wonder how long that takes to recharge. What the? What was that? That was a jump drive. Jump drive? Corrupt strike drone. Uh-oh. What? Oh, I probably need to breathe or something. You Did you bring any ex extra oxygen bottles with you? Yeah. But my helmet was open. Ah. Um, I am Ooh, going to... Oh, that's coming in pretty fast. Four... Jump. <laughs> 3.5. Whoa, what the? Hey, it's snowing. It is Christmas. <laughs> ah! Whoa. How's that for an escape plan? Uh, we, we appear to have escaped to a dangerous encounter. Sort of. Um, can you see anything down there that looks ice-like? Down where? 
On the moon. Whoa. I don't remember the moon being this big. Yes. Um, it, it all looks white. I know. Oh no, not again. <laughs> We're going to be doing this bit. This is the quickest way to get around. I think I'm going to need to clean the inside of my oh, helmet. I think... I think down there is ice. What? Down See how there's where? the lighter area? That's all the lighter area. No, there's a there's a clear line. Well, I mean, there's like there's like a third of it is the lighter area, and then two thirds of it is the darker area. I think that's the sunlight. Okay. See the large crater directly ahead of the ship? Uh, yeah. That's within the light area. No, oh, it's that's in the dark area. No, within where the terrain is actually of a different color. Trust me, it'll be fine. If you say so. I do. We're gonna go down there. If well, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Oh well. Uh, there's a hacker drone coming yeah, from above. Nine o'clock high, four kilometers out, coming very fast. Yes. Three mm. and a half. We don't want to go at full speed, unfortunately. I wonder if it's actually going to do anything, because we've got all our antenna... All of our antennae are off. Seem to be leaving it behind. Okay, I'm going to get ready to start lining up these warheads. You ready to launch once I've... Yeah. Dropped them off? Okay, um. so... Arming the warheads. Releasing warhead one. Releasing warhead two. Oops, I might have done that slightly wrong because I didn't accelerate again. Are you ready to launch? Yeah. Okay, good. Oh! What did you do? Clip the landing gear. What did you lose? Uh, I'm not sure. A couple of hydrogen thrusters. Maneuvering ones. Are you still going to be okay? Yeah. I forgot that I need to get to my other cockpit. We are getting very close. Yep. You following the warheads? Yep. There's still more of them. Ah. Oh jeez, they're blowing up. Okay. You yeah, you better get out. Oh, they actually hit tight. Oh! That wasn't too bad. I mean, my aim at the end was pretty rubbish, but my aim at the beginning was not too bad. There's actually a deep part. Well, I'm going in to check it out. Okay. I'm yeah, going to come down and hold station over you. They scattered a bit. But there was a section where they followed each other. Yep, I see it. Can you make a GPS where you are once you're in it? And share it with me so that I know where I'm going. Sure. Especially if I have to bug out. Um, I'm down to 60% fuel though. You found the deepest bit of the hole? Well, I, I put a thing at the entrance. No, as in, but you, you've you headed into the deep bit. Yes. Yeah. Ah! What, what exploded? Yeah, I lost a drill. You should be right-click mining. Yes, I know that. Did you just hit really hard? I didn't realise I was as close as I was. I deactivated my thrusters, so I got a little bit of fuel left. Oh, you almost out of fuel. I don't have a whole lot. Um, was I right? Is this ice? Well, it looks like most of what I was going through is rock. Yeah, there's ice up here. The surface is ice. Oh well, oh, I can strip it down a bit to make it a bit more uh, maneuverable. Oh yeah, there's probably a lot of... Oh, and the extra... the excess weight of stuff. If you build a... Yep, I'm gonna Cargo container built into the voxels, then you can just load that up and empty yourself out so you're a bit lighter. I'm going to start building a base down here. Don't think this hole is anywhere near big enough for me. In the cockroach. Well, once I sort of disassemble this ship, I can make it into a more maneuverable mining machine. And then I can carve out something for okay. it to fit in. So I'll, I'll try and keep near the surface. I'm giving you, getting you a little bit of extra hydrogen on board. Oh, I wonder if I could do that. 
I was able to drill using your ship, so maybe I could build a little appendage that I can add with the connector as a drill set for me to load up onto the cockroach to quickly load it up with ice. Oh yeah. That could totally work. I can't believe we just made it here with almost no problems. No problems yet. We did have a close call with some drones and now we're kind of sitting ducks. Well, I'm hoping that the accelerator- well, yeah, we are sitting ducks. Well, I mean, you're a sitting duck. I'm a sitting mole. <laughs> oh. Yep. Reaver. 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 Um, yeah? What do yeah, you want me incoming. to do about it? I'm just letting you know. Oh, I should be fine. You realize I'm your lifeline, right? Alright, I'm leaving you behind. I gotta okay. go. I don't know what a trans U is. In fact, can I look at it? Is it even coming after us? I don't know, if it's just a transport, maybe it'll ignore us. Yeah. It does seem to just be passing by. Alright, I'm gonna head back down. It's also a super gremlin. But it's just gonna be passing by, I think. Okay, is the Reaver going after us or is it going after that super gremlin? Uh, it says it's detected a nearby antenna. Yeah, but I don't know if it's us or the, oh. the super gremlin. I don't know. My antenna switched off. So is mine. Is it coming further away or is it holding there? Okay, I think it's going after the Super Gremlin. We might be able to profit from that. Oh, they're fighting. It's a lot of missiles. Let's close in and watch from a little bit of a better vantage point. Still got 73% fuel. I gotta keep an eye on that. Oh, is the river scoring some hits? Yep, it's scoring some hits now. Oh, Super Gremlin Marker is down. It is getting annihilated. I wonder if the Reaver's going to let it go. I kind of want to go close enough to see if I can pick up any of that Super Gremlin's remains. Oh yeah, it's gone down. Oh, that sun is in really inconvenient spot. Oh, I couldn't see anything. The crash happened directly in line with the sun from my position. Uh, so I don't know where exactly it crashed. Oh no, I think the Reaver might be holding station over the crash. Oh yep. It's going in for the kill. Oh, is it leaving? Please leave. Please leave. I want to see if there's any goodies that's left behind. It seemed like it completely annihilated the thing, but it's I reckon it's worth checking out. How goes the base prep there? I'm transferring all the stuff from my cargo into the cargo container I built. Okay. Then I'll start getting a base happening. Oh no, incoming Tesla drone! Oh wait! The Tesla drone should fight the Reaver ship. Or vice versa. Come on, where's that crash site? I have not found the crash site. Had hoped it'd be big enough, because that ship had shut down was pretty big. No, nah, totally can't spot the wreck. Dang. I was really hoping I'd be able to get something from that. Well, you win some, you lose some. Oh, is the Tesla drone hanging over you? Yes. 679 meters. Uh-huh. I might swing past on it then. It's kind of my role here, isn't it? Yeah, as long as you don't get exploded. Well, it's only one little drone. Should be okay. It's mostly focused on you right now. Coming in at 102 meters I've a second. Got a trans U coming this way as well. Yeah, that's the Reaver ship that I've been following. Oh, I hear explosions. Yep. That Tesla drone is down. There may be some goodies that are about to land on your head. Oh, geez, that Reaver ship is coming after me, isn't it? Yep. Time to boogie. I'll be back when I can. Okay. I gotta jump away from this thing, otherwise it's gonna get me. It had a lot of missiles. I can't jump inside the gravity field. Hopefully it doesn't start um, tracking you. I might try and lead it after me. Lead it away from you if I can. Alright, Reaver, follow me if you dare. Is the Reaver drone moving away from you? Because it looks like it's following me. Uh, yeah. Good. How far is it from you now? 
2.8, no, 3 kilometers. Okay, I still need to go much further. It's actually still closer to you than it is to me, even though it's following me. In fact, I might briefly do this. And turn my antenna on to see if I can grab its attention. How far is the reaver from you now? Uh, 8.5. Okay. That might be far enough. If I jump. That it won't go after you. Because that's my worry, that, is that it'll chase you. As soon as I get outside its targeting range. And I don't want that thing hanging over you, because I want to be able to come back. <laughs> yep. Did you bring the stuff for a medbay? Yes. Okay. Alright, I'm jumping away. We'll see what happens. Right. I've got a battery up. So I won't be able to support in a hurry now. It's got 37 days of power. Keep an eye on that reaver. Make sure it's not coming after you. 10.6, 10.7. It seems like it's moving away. Okay. Right. Well, I'm going to be doing some building on the move. Let me know when you can no longer see the reaver. Oh, jeez. There's something above me. What's there? <laughs> Kamikaze Drone Mark II. It's 1.3 kilometers above. Oh, jeez. Uh, three Kamikaze Drones Mark II. Oh. Right. So if I'm going to return, I have to clear them out. Yeah. Might get a little hairy. Yes, it might. Man, I'm glad I left a lot of equipment on board this thing. What? Is that you? What? I... Is there a hundred... Oh, jeez, it's near me. What's quick, going quick, on? Quick, 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 quick. Well, I was in space... Repair... Doing some upgrades, and then a uh, hunter drones... Ah. Come and found me. Plunge up. Yeah, there's a bunch of kamikaze drones just circling me like vultures. I wonder if you could taunt them into trying to get close enough to you but still manage to survive. I don't think so. I think my tunnel's a little more exposed than I would have liked, so if I go up to the surface it's going to drag them over towards where they'd have a straight shot down at my mining machine, at least at the moment. Oh, you've, you'll have to drill a bigger area for your machine, is that what you... Before you can do it? Possibly. My temporary drill rig is ready. So I should be able to... Scoot down to the moon, collect some ice and get back to space. So I might try and do a bit of a refuel run and see if I can do it efficiently enough... To actually manage to... Um, gain fuel out of the experience. There we go. What'd you do? We got a map bay on the moon. Oh, nice. Now you can taunt all day long. <laughs> well, rather not do that if I don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> but you can. So you are you calling your Normandy landing successful? Sure. So that's what you were calling it last week, wasn't it? When you said that forming a beachhead on the moon was a silly idea? We will fight them on the beaches. You doubted my idea. Is there another super gremlin down by you? Uh, at the moment, I've got Kamikaze Drone Mark II, Kamikaze Drone Mark II, Super Gremlin. Yeah, which is two kilometers out. <laughs> and a Trans U, which is also two kilometers out. Yeah, it's swarming. Everyone's at you. Yep. Okay. I might just steer clear of you for a little bit then. Well, I guess I'll just keep trying to get things set up. Um, I wonder what I might be able to do to aid you. Okay, it's a little hodgepodge, but I've got a large container, a battery, a med bay, a cryo tube, and a refinery. Uh huh. So if I could get to you, we're almost there. Yeah. So basically, your role now is to try and uh, find and mine gold and silver. Without getting killed. Uh, these large hydrogen thrusters should have some large steel tubes. If you've got anything that's got iron in it, you can just break it down with your assembler. 
What assembler? Oh. I mean, you'd be able to break down your other stuff to build an assembler if you really needed one. Now that is ice, isn't it? So what do we need for ion thrusters? Platinum. Which is only available on Mars. Right. But we so need the gold and silver for other stuff. Yeah. And if we can manage to establish a beachhead here, then at least we'll be able to get gold and silver whenever we need it. Yep, definitely hearing some explosions. Well, they must be fighting. It's kind of fortunate that Reaver came along in a lot of ways. Because it's a bit easier to keep track of. It's nice to know we're not the only enemies out here. Well, speak for yourself. You'd like to be the only enemy out here? I'm nobody's enemy. I'm a man of the people. I'll kill anyone that disagrees with me. Uh -huh. Is the Reaver the last one left near you? Uh, the Trans-U Reaver is, yeah, still flying about. There's a Super Gremlin five kilometers away, but yeah, it's the only one I can see at the moment. Good. Oh, that sounded close. Yeah, that Trans-U is 300 meters away. Uh-huh. That's going to be an interesting challenge to deal with it. Oh jeez. What? It's right outside the entrance of the tunnel. <laughs> ah! <gasps> oh boy. I mean, I think it's too big to fit. <laughs> <laughs> that well, could be an issue when we expand it to fit the cockroach. It could be. Right, I'll, I'll strike out a secondary tunnel and see if I can get some ice. It's alright, I'll just chill here and uh, freak out that there's a Harpoon Corvette incoming. Ah. Uh, awesome. But not really. Uh, maybe I should have brought the stuff to make a big ore detector so I could have just whacked it on the base. You may be able to get the minerals. Ah, oh, that's what I can probably do. If I head back to Earth... I might be able to make something remote controlled to try and deliver you some resources uh, that you need. Supply shuttle. Yeah. Okay. The drills are almost full, that means I am almost full of ice. Time to boogie. Might do a quick pass near the reaver, oh, see if I can get its attention. I'm beginning to doubt there even is a surface. You might be drilling into a mountain. There are a couple of tallish mountains near. Come on, Mr. Reaver. Oh, a Reaver ship has noticed a nearby beacon antenna signal. Yep. That's me. Just trying to get its attention. That Reaver up there is... near a smouldering wreck that's not falling. Oh yeah, it's guarding its Super Gremlin victim. Oh. Uh -huh. The Harpoon Corvette's after me, though. Oh, that Harpoon Corvette's coming in. Yeah, I'm trying to uh, get it to get distracted by a um, Super Gremlin that I'm flying by. Don't know if my tactic's going to work. It hasn't, hasn't changed course yet. Oh, it is smoking from one of its engines, though. What yeah, I don't think I'm going to get lucky you, with that. Are you building something on the surface? Yeah, I was going to. It was going to be my drill rig that was going to be detachable, but as it stands, it's not really an option. So there's the trans-U, where's the RP? Super Gremlin. Oh, jeez. Is the trans-U still hanging over you? Or is it left? Uh, it, yeah, it's still just derping around that wreck. That's somehow managing to keep itself above yeah. the moon. Alright, I'm out of grips of the moon. I'm going to try and drag the Reaver a lot further away this time. Because that was not good that I left that one. <laughs> and it ended up going after you. Did I get a whole lot of ice? Yes, I did. Even the cryo chambers are full of ice. Alright, I don't need a fuel run for a little while. There is a little bit of shrapnel down here from some fight. Oh yeah? Nothing it, valuable. Nothing of value. You may even want those plates though. Even if it's just armor that's in the ground. Well, whatever I can get at the moment. Yeah, pretty much. Space pirate readings. Ooh, now that 
the Reaver might be interested in. Plus it might be interesting to do a little flyby. I wonder if I've just got enough to make a thruster. What sort of thruster? An ion thruster. I just found one on a bit of wreck. Oh, did you find s s the parts? For one. Well, I found, found a, a whole, whole one. Whole thruster and I ground it down. Let's see. What are you thinking you'll make with that? Well, if I can slap it on my mining machine, that's one little less bit of hydrogen it's going to use. That's true. Okay, about to speed past an informant that is hopefully going to then engage the Harpoon Corvette. Or not. Are there any more thrusters for me up here? Oh, I think oh, I might have distracted the Harpoon Corvette with the Space Pirates. Ah. Ah. Any other goodies? I've just got another thruster. Sweet. I'll just keep derping around up here then, shall I? <laughs> sure. Right, let's have a look at this thing. Ah, a hive ship is telling me I'm facing extermination. That's not good. Okay, this thing seems to have a small enough number of turrets that I could probably take it on. And it has some big ion thrusters too. I just can't... Whoops! Oh, that didn't sound good. Did not realise I got within range! Did I take any damage of significance? Oh yeah. Corrupt hive ship coming in on my position four kilometers out. Well, not so much from my salvaging operation. Alright, time to jump. Time to jump. Time to jump. Time to jump before the Raider Corps. The Reaper Corvette gets me. Alright. There we go. Are those two fighting? And I just can't see it. If I could just get a couple more, I could make a little flyer that I could fly up to the surface. And take the solar panels off this thing to keep it powered up. Uh oh, deploying horsefly drones. Okay, I might stay underground for a little while. <laughs> I think this Reaver might be badly damaged. Oh, these drones can probably get down the tunnel. That's not good. Those two should be fighting and they're not firing, either of them. Oh, now there's a strike vet coming in. That's not cool. It's just annoying. I thought I might have had a chance to get these things, but no. It's probably going to get here too soon. Oh, although if I don't try and attract its attention with my antenna, I should be fine. Oh man, these guys just won't leave us alone. No, they really won't. Is there enough moon for everyone to share? Apparently not. Oh, those horse flight okay, drones are really trying to get me. Destroyed. Oh, I can't quite make out the other turret. The Reaver ship seems to be in a bad way. Oh man, these would be so valuable if I could get these. I wish you could be here to help. I don't know that I could do all that much. Well, a, a potential suicide mission might actually be useful here. The sort of suicide mission you are actually normally willing to take. Alright, I'm Not making... Not some expendable foot soldier that you could just throw at your enemy and clog their gun barrels with blood? I'm going to jump out and jump back. Where's that strike, Where's that strike combat going? It's still coming toward me. Oh no, it's heading towards the space pirate base. I need to clear myself out of this area. Damn force fly drones. Oh, okay. that made him so angry. Up. <laughs> what ah. did you do? Shot one of them. <laughs> you bit the horsefly. Yes. Oh no! The hive ship is deploying kamikaze drones now. So there's three horsefly drones. It's deploying three kamikaze drones as well. Oh man. Oh, I don't know what these corvettes are up to. I really want to investigate. There's a harpoon corvette, a strike corvette, and an enemy space pirate base. And yeah. I think the Reavers are fighting the space pirate, but the first Reaver that got there was badly damaged um, and appears to be deactivated. The second one's just gotten there fresh. And if only it hadn't turned up, I would have been able to take these guys on. I think. But it's guarding what would have been my haul. I don't know what to do. 
Well, I've got six drones trying to murder me. <laughs> I think I may have to get used to the fact that I may never be leaving the surface of the moon. This is my or new home. underneath the surface of the moon. Until I run out of air and food and water. Well, you've got ice, don't you? Did you manage to get any? I got a, like two loads that I could carry from the surface, but okay. that's it so far. When you get desperate, I'm sure you'll be able to get more. Great. Let's try and get in a little closer. Oh yeah. I am doing some damage. I may be taking some hits though. It was adequately distracted. Ah. Uh -huh. I may have three wrecks. <laughs> if I if I can get them, I'm taking them back to Earth. Because I don't think I'll be able to scrap them up here. You're gonna try to lock onto them. If I can, I'm gonna make another pass. I think you'll be able to grab all three? What I'm thinking of is if I can grab all three, I can then put a bunch of parachutes on here and use the parachutes to safely get down to Earth. Uh -huh. yeah, unless your guns blow everything to bits. Yeah, I think we're okay. I'm not getting shot. Oh no, now I'm getting shot again. Oh, definitely taking some fire now. Got a boogie, 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 boogie. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Three turrets are down. Oh, it's so hard to get an angle. I haven't seen any sign of minerals yet. Okay, the space pirate base is neutralized. Don't know how much I'm gonna get from all this, but I have to keep shooting because I think I'm still taking hits. Yep, I'm definitely still taking hits. Oh jeez. Oh, something exploded. It wasn't mine. Oh damn. I've been depressurized. I think. That's not good. Okay, my helmet's on. Yeah, this is totally worth it if I can get this... Get these racks. Well, I'm trying to dig a tunnel to Moon Zone 1. <laughs> that... That... Uh, is an interesting course of action. I figure it's as good a direction as any other. It's only 10 kilometers away from here, so... Should be there in no time. I think there are at least some gold boulders on the surface there. Nearby, anyway. Ah, come on, shoot the one that's alive. Stop shooting the other one. Oh no, I lost its front thruster. Oh dear. Oh, that's not looking good. Oh! That's not looking Jeez. good at all. Definitely made that pass a bit too slow. Although, all of their markers are now gone. Now's your chance, then. Oh, hive ship's deploying more drones after me. How much more freaking firepower does this thing have? It's got to almost be dead now. Okay, that doesn't seem to have any guns on it. I need to be able to take control of a turret on top. Oh! Just hit me! Oh jeez, I've lost something big. I think. Oh man, there's... Oh! Oh, that's what happened. Your seat's loose. Great. So I've got chunks flying around with near my face. And it keeps messing with my third person camera. <laughs> there's a loose fire extinguisher! Oh man, it took a lot of damage. I hope this is worth it. Okay, that's 
some quick repairs done in there. Alright, I think those drones are dead. Time to do what I was planning. Are you sure there are even are minerals on the moon? Yes, I saw some as I was flying by. Oh man. If you could see the cockroach right now, you'd be so upset with me. What are you doing to a poor cockroach? Apparently setting everything that can be on fire, on fire. Oh damn, something is 200 meters away from me, that can't be good. <laughs> that cannot be good. What the? Oh, the hive ship has given up. Although it did just deploy more drones. Damn it. I thought you were dead too. Whoa, kablamo. Jeez, this thing is huge. It's as big as I am. Damn. Come on, come on. Let me get you. It's still alive, but it's not got any guns. Just trying to get at it. Was that you I could see? Oh great, there's a horse slide drone incoming. Yep, that'd be one of mine. You strayed back into my zone. Uh, thankfully my jump drives aren't dead. I wonder if one of these dudes crash landed or something. Oh well, maybe. Oh no, because I'm not in I'm not in I wasn't in the gravity well, so I shouldn't have been able to. They shouldn't have dropped. Well, one of them is now within 20 meters of me. Oh, one of the dudes going after you, you mean? Yeah. Uh, yeah, probably. Oh, jeez. What? What? I just broke through the surface. There are two drones right here. You need to use your words. I can't see what's going on. I need to take the ion thrusters, is what I need. Oh! Well, that explains a few things. What? That one's got atmospheric thrusters. No wonder it's struggling. Oh, they got reactors on them too. Damn, I'm almost out of cargo space. I think if I can grab the Space Pirate raiding station, then I'll try and do a manda. do a ground assault against the um, Reaver ship that's there, assuming my med bay is still intact. Sure. Because if the med bay is not intact, then it's dead. That, I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm going to keep trying to get these drones that are parked at the top of this tunnel here to fall down into the tunnel so I can steal all their bits. Like a sand lion. Okay. Locked to it. Alright, let's do this thing. Check med bay. Med bay is intact. All right. Whoa. Really can't see my way out. All right, where's the nearest corrupt ship? All right, I found the power on one side. What about this side? I think I might have enough thrusters now to make a small vehicle. Nice. I think I might have found all the power sources on this thing, so I might be able to neutralize it so that it'll stop moving as much. Alright. Oh, it's still got power. Where is its other power source? Oh, don't tell me they're doubled on both sides. They totally are. Dang it. It's got like 20 reactors on this thing. Ah. Uh. Oh, it is like a space station, isn't it? No, this is one of the Reaver ships. Oh. Reaver fighter, 10 kilometers out. That doesn't sound good. Man, throwing away plate left, right, and center, but that's the quickest way for me to do this. All right, is it dead? Yes. Okay, where's my ship? Oh no, where's my ship? Don't tell me you've lost the cockroach. I've lost the cockroach. The, well... How? <laughs> um... Ah, there it is. Because it doesn't have an antenna on it. This does, it's got two. Nope. The cockroach has no antenna. Yeah, it does, it's got two long ones. Nope. Our cockroach has no antenna. Viewers will understand what I'm talking about. Yes, that's why I clarified what I was saying. Yeah, you clarify away. Right, there it 
Is it? I thought that hive ship said it was leaving. This place is still swarming with whatever these things are. <sighs> There's something on this that's controlling the ship. Back here, ah, computer. It was a station. That was the problem. No. Now I can move. Stop. What? Why? What's going on? I'm trying to grind this computer and it's fleeing. <laughs> All right. Once I collect, I'm just going to go for one of the Reaver ships. I'm not going to go for both. I think getting too greedy could be my downfall. It's a possibility. So my plan is grab this thing, then get underway with dampers off, and then try and build as many parachutes as I can, probably about 15 or 20. Load them up. And then drop back to the planet, hopefully near our original base. Sure. And then spend about two weeks grinding these things down to get resources from them. Slash adding the Reaver ship to the cockroach. What? Adding it to the cockroach? Well, that was the plan, wasn't it? For our salvaged ships to be agglomerated to it? I don't know. I feel like plans have kind of gone out the window at this point. <laughs> you make a valid point. Yeah, there's a lot of explosions happening now. You getting missile strikes, you think? Not sure. There's so many markers on my HUD, I can't tell what's going on. Oh, I think it might be the Reaver fighter. I think it's going around taking out the drones. So, I, I finally made to managed to get the lock onto the, um, what's it called, onto the Reaver ship. However, it's got a remote control block on it and now I can't pilot my ship. I can get myself some speed up though so that I'm at least a little harder to hit. Whoa! Risky doing this stuff though. Jeez. What's up? I just saw, I was looking at the end of the tunnel and I saw the Reaver fighter fly past and shoot two missiles. <laughs> Luckily, not at me. Yeah, it must be going after the drones. Aha! I think that's the remote control. Still not enough. This thing is too heavy. Is it still full of ores or ice or something? No. Have you emptied everything out? No, everything's out of it. I think it's just the big... Like the hydrogen tanks. Well, if you've got the ion thrusters, do you need the hydrogen tanks anymore? Uh... Well, I wanted to confirm that I had enough for it to fly before I started removing the hydrogen gear. Yeah, that's fair. It's probably oh, sensible. I'll see if I can grab some more from the wrecks. Oh, my airspace has cleared up a bit, thanks to that Reaver fighter. Looks like there's just one kamikaze drone left. Don't see any more ion thrusters. Aha! Come on, grind, damn it! I don't like being exposed with that kamikaze drone just hanging out up there. Oh yeah, this terrain is littered with busted up ships. For <laughs> that? Oh, a big gun. Oh, I don't have enough computers to repair it and get the bullets. You could be care you could carefully grind it and you might be able to get them. This one's still moving. Ah, uh, what's the least important things? Oh, I'll just run it back. <laughs> Are you becoming salvage, Kapak? Yes. No more piracy for you. You're, you're into salvage now. Get some good stuff. I suppose it's less risk, too. I don't know if I'd say that. There is a kamikaze drone hovering like 1.3 kilometers above me. <laughs> yeah, it's not ideal. Maybe it's dead. Well, you can always go out and find out. Mm. <laughs> Not that convinced. Well, might be worth checking out. But I should probably drop off this stuff first. Oh damn, this one's got the mother load. What'd you get? Oh, I've just got heaps of thrusters. So you're really managing to do quite well without me. Well done. Yeah, so far. Well, you haven't died yet, have you? Or have you? No, not yet. Oh. 
<laughs> I love how you say not yet. Well, I am about to go check out this drone that's derping around. Here we go. And if my Atmo thrusters are working, I should just be able to drop these guys on the ice lake and then I can land separately, making the landing with the cockroach much more well, it's not shooting safer. me. Well, that's good. Maybe it is deactivated. Oh, it's not deactivated. But maybe it's de-armed? Disarmed? It seems like that might be the case. Oh! <laughs> so close. Uh, you gotta go get your stuff. Well. You didn't leave your drill or anything on your person, did you? You did, didn't you? That's fine. I like how my body location is five kilometers up in the air. That's great. Oh, what is that? Oh, no. What? I think there's things chasing me. And I think my body is flying away from me at high speed. Oh. Stupid exploding drone! Oh, did it explode? I thought it shot you. Yeah, as soon as I got near it, it just went blam! Oh. Right in my face. <laughs> the last thing I saw was its, was its evil AI camera glaring at me menacingly. Before I burnt to a crisp and catapulted into deep space. Oh, let me grind this thing. Yeah. Uh, I think it's going to despawn before I get to it. Well, at least it's kind of peaceful out here. <laughs> You're always such a positive individual. I'll give you that. Maybe I should order a pizza. I think they deliver to the moon. Uh, doubtful. I'm going to try and deliver to you, though. That is my intent. So is it going to be, like, totally remote controlled? Um, if I can get a shield up, I might pilot it directly and come to you with the shield. Because at least then I should be able to survive the run if I can get into your base. So the idea would be to just basically do it like a blockade run. Uh-huh. And hope that the shields just hold out long enough. <laughs> the backpack! Oh, there Have it goes. look at this. Despawned. The backpacks have maneuvering thrusters on them. They should be able to hold yeah, they position. they should. Um, do you reckon you'll... You've, have you got an assembler up yet? No. I don't know what I need to make one. You probably have to start grinding away other blocks and things to build one. I don't know. When I get back, oh, if you don't I have a get grinder. back, I'll look into it. You don't have a grinder, do you? What? You lost your grinder. Uh... Yes. Oh. I might have collected enough salvage to make one. I did get some bits But you don't have a welder, so you can't build an assembler. Uh... Yes. Okay, so I'm going to have to make an automated drone just to deliver you tools really, really quickly. Possibly. Okay. That's doable. Um... I'm trying to think of what I can do. I could still... I can still build stuff onto my mining ship. How? No, I can't. I don't have a weld. <laughs> um... You really needed to have gotten that assembler up. Oh! Well, I wasn't expecting um, something to blow up in my face. I know what you can do. Especially not after I was goaded into checking it out. I know what you can do. Kill myself by just splatting into the surface of the moon at high speed. Unknown signals often carry tools. Uh, they'd be in the cargo container, though. Yeah, which you can often directly access from outside. Well, I'll keep my eyes out, but... So if you see one, it's worth making a run for it. Uh, also to note, Capac and I are going to kind of roleplay this, that he can't spawn back at Earth. Yeah? Yeah. Nobody told me that. <laughs> We're totally doing that. Great. <laughs> otherwise, where's the, the, otherwise, it's just too easy. Too easy for who? You. And me. Easy for the guy in the giant gun festoon spaceship to say. Hey, you should see how much fire there is on this thing. I it don't want to see how much fire there is on that thing. <laughs> it is not in a good state. Alright, time to jump. Alright, if I turn off my HUD indicators, it's a lot less scary up here. 
This is an agglomeration of epic perco- pro- precautions? Proportions. Burned, 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 burned. What? Shut up. <laughs> Stop making fun of me. You should see the size of the thing I've put together. And down toward the planet I go. So next time, I'm going to try and land this thing, and I'm going to try and rescue Capac. I don't need rescuing. You've got no tools. You've got no ability to build stuff. I'm digging out a hangar. And you're stuck on the moon. I mean... I'm I'm pleased that you... Like, it's not an urgent rescue, but you do need rescue. Or do you want me to just leave you there? I've flown back to Earth from the moon before. (laughs) Would you rather I fly to you, though? Maybe. Yeah, exactly. So there's all that, and plenty more to come. And this fireball will see you then. Have a look at what I've got. Yeah, that <laughs> looks like a re-entry nightmare. <laughs> oh man. This is ridiculous.